So in this tutorial we will see how we can use an optocoupler for N26 or 37 for detecting the peak of the for detecting the polarity of the AC waveform. So this is a six pin uh, optocoupler with one first pin not connected. On between two and three we have to give uh, the AC power supply via a step down transformer. This five number pin is connected with the VCC which is normally 5 volts via 1 kilo ohm resistance and we will get the output through it. So when we will be applying the positive half cycle between 2 and 3 is connected an LED that will turn on and we will be getting no signal here because this will be on so this will also on so we will not be getting any signal but when this is reverse bias we will be getting a signal. So in order to uh, see how it works let us uh, move to our uh, experimental setup here. Uh, this is our uh, uh, step down transformer it is connected with the ac supply here and it is uh, getting 110 volts here so it will give us uh, around uh, 10 volts at the input so at the input we have connected a 1 kilo ohm resistance here we have uh, connected our oscilloscope probe on the negative and the positive side and on the secondary side we are having this uh, biasing voltage via a resistance connected with the pin number uh, 5 and on the pin number 4 is the ground. So we have our, our probe connected here such that as you can see here it is uh, it is it is uh, connecting uh, pin number 5 uh, with the positive and the negative is uh, connected with it. So this is the experimental results here as you can see here on channel number 2 uh, we are having a, a 3.91 volt RMS and you can see whenever there is a positive uh, half cycle we have uh, 0 volt for the negative half cycle we are getting the 1. So in this way we can detect the AC polarity using an optocoupler. Thank you very much.